Hey guys, we have an hour long follow me around vlog, a follow me around Beverly Hills. And if you want to support this channel, shop sadboy2005.com, apparel available now. Guys, we are in Beverly Hills. Oh, did you get the pictures? I didn't What are you posting? Oh, you're posting an alarm. I was just setting an alarm because they only have one hour parking. That says three hour. That one is one hour. Oh. Dang. We're in our matching Sad Boy outfits in Beverly Hills. We're celebrating Sad Boy Lawn, SadBoy2005.com. This was the one I didn't even really want in the collection, and then I saw Moses have it. And, oh, I'm showing the shirts. <laughs> I saw Moses have it, and then I was like, oh, I need it too. I was so cute. So I got one, and I'm obsessed with these. These are my favorite. Sometimes you just need outside like people to be like, you know what, this is cute. And I was like, oh, okay. Oh, wait. So we're going to, I love this restaurant. It's called El, I don't know how you say it, El Pastel. El Paseo, it's like right there. Last time I got the truffle pasta and it was like so freaking good. But I probably won't get the truffles on it. I'll just get the butter noodles because it was like butter spaghetti. <laughs> yeah. But it was really good. Let's see if there's a wait. Oh no, it looks so crowded outside. El pasta. It's their menu. menu. Oh, thank you so much. Cheers. Sad boy launch. You look so cool and you're a sad boy. We already, we already got compliments on our matching shirts at the hostess stand. <laughs> Like, I love your matching shirts. It's so cute. <laughs> this is my pasta. I got butter noodles and parmesan, and I'm so excited because it's my cheat day. I got angel, angel hair. Yeah, that looks good too. Yeah. These are literally the best noodles ever. They're cooked to absolute perfection. I know they're basic, but. This is what I crave when I got to eat. It's so good. Okay, so we were looking for Alfred's tea and then we came by and we saw this pink mobile and it looks really cool. And I don't know what they said. Hi, how are you? <laughs> yeah, of course. Oh, you look so good. Oh, thanks, Eddie. Yeah. Alfred's coffee shop. Can we get some matcha? <laughs> <laughs> More? More matcha? <laughs> oh, that's cool. Tea, yes. You, maybe. What? <laughs> it's a very LA coffee shop. Moses Matthews. I'm literally sweating everywhere we go, but it's okay. We're at this really bougie LA coffee shop called Alfred's Coffee. It's so cool. It's like a work of art in here. I love it. Huh? I used to come here. I used to come here too. I used to come here when I was trying to get paparazzi. I was like, let me just come here at Subway to Five, promo it. <laughs> we were in the area, so we went, and then Pacifica gave us a goodie bag, so it looks really exciting too. I got more green matcha latte with vanilla sweetener. Let's see if this is better than the other matcha. Uh, yeah, this is so much better. I need to blot my face because it's freaking hot and I'm like greasy, but this is so we just went to a place where I couldn't film because the music was so loud, but we just went to a place and I had matcha and it was like actual matcha and I wanted to puke. But this matcha latte with vanilla cream. Did you try the matcha at the other place? No, I didn't. Oh. I didn't even try it. Yeah, that one's good. I mean, the other one was good. The rose one. Yeah, that one's more better. So honestly, that tastes more like just almond milk with vanilla. Well, it's obviously matcha if it's cream. It's good. I like him. Good job, Alfred's. Mocha. <laughs> oh, always the mocha. Oh, those people that said hi to me are doing a little photo shoot. They look like they were being models. Should I go ask them if they need a model? I'll be also be in there for you. <laughs> go in with that. boy. Sad boy modeling shoot. It's a model. Oh, look at the walking. She's doing actually really good. She's walking forward. They're taking. Oh, just with their oh, cell phone. I love it. I love it. I would film them because I think it's cool, but like people might think I'm making fun of them, so I'm not gonna film them. But okay, I really want to film her, but I just I know if someone was filming me, I'd be pissed, big. But but I think she's killing it, and I would give her words of encouragement. But also, oh, that one is the one that was yeah. that wanted a picture. Oh, interesting. Was that her boss then that she was taking pictures of? No, my guess is that they're friends. One of them is a student that designed the clothes. Uh, and they're doing like a little photo shoot for it. But she was saving the spot for her boss. 
Oh, I didn't hear that. Yeah, she goes, I was holding the spot for my boss, but then I saw you come, so I gave it to you. And I was like, I'm so sorry. That's why I said I felt bad. I was like, oh, she's like. Oh, I thought a friend. I thought she said like a man. No, she's holding it for her boss. And I was like, oh, shit. So shout out. Oh, I forgot her name. I asked her name and I forgot it. Shout out to the person on Melrose Plays. <laughs> she was standing in, the, in a parking spot and, you know, you don't know the person. So you're like, I hope that person just moves because she was holding it for someone that wasn't even close. But they did move. And it was really nice. And then when I when I got out, she was like, "Okay, oh, have a picture. And I was like, okay. But I felt really bad. Like, I just feel bad because I was like, oh. I mean, even though, like, I mean. Oh, Moses she did... saw you and she gave it to you. Yeah. So shout out to you. Thank you for that. You didn't have to do that. Honestly, <laughs> like, I would because I hate confrontation. I'm like, okay, I'm leaving. I'm getting on the spot. But honestly, I can also respect people who can hold a spot for somebody and not care that they get yelled at because that could never be me. So if that's you and you can do that, that's, that's Moses over here. Yeah. <laughs> He did that one time. I mean, granted, like, the car was right behind him. But he did that one time, and I was like, cringe. I cringe. I wasn't even there. I wasn't even, like, close to the proximity of the car. But I was cringing <laughs> so hard. And we saw an 88. And I don't know if you saw the guy's neck tattoo when we walked into Alfred's. He had 1988 on his, too. Oh, I've been wow. seeing 88. I know it's just because I'm, like, seeing 88. But the place where we want to get my car to, the address is 8833, which is my birthday and my year. And I just, and I told a girl that had the 1988 on her necklace at Pacifica, I was like, oh, I keep seeing 88 and we're going to be 33 and we're going to year 20. I mean, she probably did not care, but I was, yeah, I was very she excited. Was, she was falling. I just get so excited. I feel like that's, that's all signs. I just feel it in the, I feel it. Mark my words. In the next, when do I turn 34? Before I turn 34, like crazy. It's going to be explosive things happening. You're going to be like, whoa, Trish, how did this happen? And we're like, it's the numbers. We're getting married. No. And I think honestly, that's so cool. And like the fact that we're getting married, like on a double digit as well. Like it just, it just all feels so right. Did you see that bag on the Black. But I agree with you, yes. The Baron's the beginning of us, yes. Did you see that bag that has the date on it? When you see it, it's so pretty. Our wedding day. Oh, the, in my, at the house, the one I have? Yeah. I and love when it. When you see it, I don't know why, like, suddenly when I saw it, I was just like, wow, this mm -hmm. is like a beautiful number. I love that bag. I want to use it, but like it has my address, or has our, um, <laughs> our date everywhere on it. I look like Tammy Faye Baker. <laughs> and I love it. I'm not mad at it. <laughs> <laughs> no, she is, she is like white or silver up here. Oh, yeah, I do That's love that. what really makes her stand out or like the clown look like people were joking about. Oh, so mean. Uh, no, I like her. I support her. No, I know. I'm saying they were so mean. Yeah. I support her. She's dead now, her. but... She is? Yeah. She died like 10 years ago. Oh, because didn't we see something... Her husband's alive. Or her ex-husband. Oh, wow. Because he looks he's young. He's 80. He's not young. He's 80, the pictures we saw? Yeah. Wow. He's just like kind of bald, so I guess you can't really see. But yeah, he's 80. Wow. I really want to go to his church and speak on the PTL. What, are we, what did PTL stand for? Wait, why don't... <laughs> um, uh... PTL. Prayer. <laughs> I don't know. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was Praise no. the Lord Network. Yeah, it was. Oh, really? Yeah. That was good. Good job. I was like, wait, I why? Really? Because I thought the T is there. And I was like, what's there? Like, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. That makes sense. I want to go on it. That's so funny. I mean, I really do love Jesus. They should give you a own show. I would do it for free. Just show up with a puppet. Yeah. <laughs> that's how they started. She just made that puppet. He's married to someone named Tammy, and it looks just like Tammy Faye. And she wears the makeup and the blonde hair. No. Yeah. Maybe, maybe he, like, maybe she's playing on his memory. Like, he doesn't remember, and like, it's oh my really God. funny. <laughs> oh, my God. Wouldn't that be crazy? You never know. People be crazy like that. I mean, the fact he's married to another Tammy. Yeah. I don't know if I can marry another Moses. I guess he has a type. He probably will. Oh, yeah. I guess I could go to Israel. There's a lot of them over there. <laughs> <laughs> I just If I just see a Mos Moses on Tinder over there, I just swipe for all of them. But that would be like if you were like dead or something. Then I'd want to go replace you. I wouldn't do it while you're living. I wouldn't be like, okay, we're divorced. Let me go find a Moses. We were talking about me being dead. I wasn't <gasps> talking about me being alive. Oh, no. I wasn't talking about you being dead. I wasn't talking about that. But I was now. But we haven't been. <laughs> Don't act like that was just a discussion we've been having. Like, oh, we talked about me being dead. 
Oh, no, no, I mean now. Like, oh, when, okay. When you were saying you replaced me, I'm like, oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I didn't think about it. I would have to. I don't think I could, like, I don't think I could live. I would have to find, I mean, I know it's, like, unhealthy, but I think I'd have to find someone that was like you, like, to replace you. I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, I, I you know, I, in a way, I'd rather you be with someone like me because then I know you loved me and you want someone else to be like me. But I don't know, like, if you found someone, like, completely different, but, oh, he never really, he always wanted that. I don't think it exists. What? Someone like you. I just gotta take these off and then I'll hold them again. Um, well, you that's true. Car. No, but you can find another, you know, blonde. <laughs> but that's not what. Well, that's not the reason I'm with you. Do you think that I'm more Jewish because I wear wigs all the time? It's very Jewish thing to <laughs> do. You, do you think of that? Do you think, like, no. oh, I do it for that reason? That's the first thing I think about. I kind of think about it when they put the wigs on. I kind of feel like I'm being coming holy. <laughs> You could, I mean, you cover your natural hair, so. Maybe people think that because I used to never wear wigs and now I'm wearing wigs. I mean, that's how funny the religion is. It will actually encourage you to wear wigs. I love and, it. I'm and you know what's the funniest part? The wigs could be made out of human hair. So, you're actually. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, what is it? It's just, what is the point? What is it again? Just to cover your head? It's for modesty, right? Do you want to be modest? So you want to cover your natural hair. Why the hair? Why not your face? Why don't they cover the face? Well, if you become extreme, then you become Muslim and you cover the face too. But, so, mm -hmm. I don't know. People think like hair, it's like sexy. It's distracting. True. It's, you know, so they want to but cover But this it. is distracting. So you should, that's what I'm saying. That's why it's so funny. Literally so hot. I can't take it. I mean, my makeup looks bomb today, but it is freaking hot. And I'm in long sleeve. Like, it was fall weather and now I don't know. Oh, what's that fucker name? I just cannot. It's really bad lighting. Mm. There's literally such bad lighting. Um, lighting makes literally all the difference. Hey, the boss. All right, that's butter toffee by NYX. I love the stuff I get. Get off Amazon. Let's see this lighting. It makes still so crazy. We're in my old hood, a studio city. It's, it's like literally so scary. Not even just like the rundownness of it. It's just like things are abandoned. People aren't out. I'm like, what happened? This used to be like everything. This is so gross. Where do I put these? Is there trash? This is girls. Sorry. Thank you. How are you doing? Are you standing guard? It looks like you were watching. No, I'm for shade. <laughs> oh. You wanna come in, but while we wait, it looks hot as shit out there. It is. You look cool though in the subway. Should I take a picture of you pumping gas while you're in the subway? People have been asking me like, hey, what'd you get this shirt, dude? No, they haven't. What? I'm gonna take a picture of you. Can I take a picture of you? Okay. We're pumping gas. You cutie. Get my shoes. Oh, I love these shoes, let me show them. Wow, I love them. You look fly today. I like all black red shoes. And we're gonna go look for the spider cups at Target. And I hope they have it. This kind of makeup is cute today. Okay. <laughs> oh, hi, how are you? Hey, <laughs> nice to meet you. <laughs> so we are at Target. Uh, we're looking for these spider cups because we look like spider webs today. Like the cups would match our outfits so perfect. It's like the perfect aesthetic. So we're at Target. It smells so good. What's that smell? I, just, I was smelling it. Mm, it smells it's like barbecue. Like you know where we should go is Wood Ranch. We never dress up as our Brokeback Mountain. We were gonna go to Wood, I was gonna go to Wood Ranch and eat those. They have those beef ribs. Well, we can um, <gasps> like really try out before the music video. <laughs> In our outfits? <laughs> Some form of it. Oh. Um, boots, hats. Oh. 
beef rub sounds so good. I don't know why I'm hungry. We had this huge thing of pasta today, but we're really kind of hungry. So no, I think I know it's my cheat day. Of all, we eat really early. Right. So, I mean, like, yeah, I'm ready for dinner. I think knowing that it's like a cheat day and I was going to eat pizza and pasta today, I got excited and I'm more hungry as if I know I'm just going to restrict myself a little bit, but. It wasn't um, that much. Masks are on. Oh no. I don't see them. No. 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 Yeah. It's not the spider cups. I got hair on my lip. No. So we can when we drive back we'll drive up Lindero. Yeah, go to the one that I like. Update, they do not have the spider cups. It's up, but that's okay. Ooh, look at all these fall things. Cool. Mmm, yummy. I want all these. They look so good. Okay, so we're doing a Twilight inspired sketch. So we got Jacob and Bella pose. Do you know your one line so far? The one line? Oh, Bella, where, where the hell have you been? <laughs> Is he saying, where the hell? No, he says something like, <laughs> oh, Loka, where have you been, Loka? <laughs> but does, I feel like he does say how. No, no, no. Bella, where? Oh, Twitter babies, let's see if there's one more. Where have you been, Loka? Hey, Bella. Something like that. Where have you been, Loka? <laughs> no, I don't yeah. even know either. We have what? the Glitter Baby sock. Is the pink there? No, we have that one. No. I mean, is there others? No, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, wait, here. So there's. <gasps> we need the purple one. She's nowhere to be Lila. found. Oh, they do. Then. <laughs> oh, January. <laughs> Dreamia. I like our names better. Sarah. Okay. Now we gotta go find. See if they have the Pepsi soda shop, the LaCroix, and the fish sticks for my live shows. Bella, where the hell have you been, Loka? <laughs> Moses is going to the candy section. <laughs> I, was like, I didn't know what you were doing. I was like, oh my god, are you okay? I'm doing the, wait, yeah, I got wait, it. You look like her. <laughs> you look like both Jacob and Bella at the same time. And I'm not mad at it. Oh, look at all this new stuff. Wow. You can build yeah, a haunted mansion. Wow. Why are those so big? Or I don't understand. <laughs> oh, yeah, we need these. Although I'm more of a Butterfinger bitch these days, but I, this looks cool. Whatever that is, I'll Whoa. take it. Okay, judgy. <laughs> no, I'm just saying, this thing is heavy. Damn, whoa. So heavy. Hi! Oh my god, your dog is so cute. <laughs> I was wondering if you could get a picture with him. Yeah, what's his name? Coco. Is he okay to hold up? Oh, yeah, he's totally good. <laughs> <laughs> is it a picture or a video? Both. Okay. Coco. Her. her. No, it's a guy. Oh, okay, we love yeah. that. <laughs> he's so cute. He's like He's, like, He's good though. He's 13. Yeah. Aww. So cute. Mucky would love him. My sister always brings her palms with her. Like, You're so cute. Why are you so shaky? He has shaky dogs. Yeah. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> like, it, it, we call it little dog syndrome. Oh, like, they shake. Dog. Okay. Aww, he's so cute. Thank right you for letting me for hold him. He's so proud. I saw the dog and I was like, oh, thank you. <laughs> Do you guys want a picture? Oh, he stopped. Oh, maybe because he's going back to mommy. Yeah, can we get a picture <laughs> Yeah, you? yeah, for sure. You had it before? Yeah, Moses picks those. Literally the worst candies what you can it? get. They're like... No, I just lifted it. Like, like, what is it? It's like marzipan. It's like thick. Oh. <laughs> it's like, I was like, ooh, I mean... That's heavy. I like Muddy Buddies, Pandas, Cheese Balls. You pick these out of everything? Oh. Oh, excuse me. Excuse no me. candy shaming here. <laughs> you can have them if you want. What is this? Cheese Balls. Oh. Literally says cheese balls. <laughs> cheese balls are great. I love a cheese ball. Right. I'm surprised you like a cheese ball. Popcorn they tins. Have so many. I know. That's good. Pringles. I don't see any Halloween Butterfingers though. I'm in the Butterfinger cake right now. I'm sure they is. <laughs> I mean, we literally have two gates, so I think that's a no. <laughs> no. We're shutting off all our lights on Halloween. Oh, these are cool. These Halloween Ziplocs. Cute. Need this for sure, too. 
Are you overwhelmed by all the candy? Look at Moses, so excited. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Oh my God. Wow. Those are cool. Those look good in there. Add it to the cart. I'm coming right back. Just checking out the new backpacks. Mm. Nothing today. Do you want these pumpkins? These are oh, these are candy corns. That's a good. That's how they taste. Get candy corn. So that's too much. Are you candy sure? corn are like too much. It's like solid sugar. Okay. I feel like you wanted them, and I talked you out of it. No, I was just looking at actual pumpkins. Oh my god, who would want this pop Funko? <laughs> no, thank you. No, no, never. Not in a million years. Can we get that giant stay puffed? Where can we put him? Well, if we put it somewhere that the neighbors can see, you know. No, why, did, why? Why do they need to see? Why can't we just have it for us to see? Because it's fun to get the neighborhood in the mood. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, you look cool, Matt. You look, oh my God, you look just like that Pirates of the Caribbean guy I always say you look like, Commander Norrington. Oh my God, you literally look like him. Commodore Norrington. You should get that hat. It's cool. We get a pirate TikTok or Trish talks. <laughs> you look so cool in it. Oh my god! Where can we put that? Wow, that's so cool. Is it sold out? It probably is. Hans, all picked over. Dang, that's cool. No, man, that would have been so cool. How is it sold out? I love our little ones by the TV. Mm. Should we get the little the giant spider? Or more lights? Projection. Yeah, let's get a projection. Oh yeah, this is cool. I like those. Yeah, let's get those. Oh, scary. What is that? Will we be able to see it from inside? Yeah, that's cool. We need that. We need that. We need that. That's so cute. Oh my god, I love that. I wish that was in stock. Oh, that's so cute. My favorite section of Target. Toilet paper. I love this so much. But not as much as I love that person right there holding the toilet paper. What a I sight. Like what, what a sight. Yeah, that's that's the pick. Now we gotta go get boring paper towels. I hate getting paper towels, but we need them. We got room for these? Yep. Thanks. Like supermarket suite, we're partners in this. We need pens for my manifestation journals. And that's it for me. Okay. Do we need anything else? Soaps? Oh, I need spray deodorant. I always run out of that stuff. Got pens, I got blue pens, black pens, and black pens and colorful coated. I love pens. And spray on deodorant. That completes our target trip. We were on our way out and then sucked us in with these happy Thanksgiving and the turkey plates. So cute, had to get. All right, so we're on our way to find a Starbucks. I have to do a live show in 20 minutes, but I know Starbucks is gonna put me in the perfect mood for this. I'm in a good mood all day today. I love being glam. I love that the sad boy launched today. I love all of it. We had pasta. I'm having pizza later. I'm very excited, um, but we're gonna go look to my favorite Starbucks drive through That got me the apron. They always just seem to know. So this time I'm gonna order. Last time I was like, hey, do you have any Halloween cups? Like, no, but we're gonna keep one for you. So we'll see if they did. I'm not gonna hold it against them if they don't, but I'll be really impressed if they did. But I love the Starbucks. This is my Starbucks. I love it so much. Also, I need to tell people that, good job. <laughs> Going through the yellow light. Um, I don't mind when people come up to me in public. I never mind that. Everyone's like, I know you hate when people come up to you, but two people said that to me today. I don't, I, I never mind that. I, oh, it's when I'm sitting in my car alone, like eating and I'm like by myself in the passenger seat and someone like comes up and like knocks on it and like, hey, I get like, so I get so, that, that scares me a little bit. But if I'm like out in a, if I'm like walking Target, like that's my peeps, that's my demographics. That's like, I, I get really excited and, um, Especially nowadays, anyone who even cares about me, I'm always just like, yeah, the last girl, she seemed excited. And I was like, you want a picture? She goes, no, that's okay. I think she like wasn't trying to impose, but I felt so bad. I was like, usually I just be asking now because I feel like people like are scared of me now because I said I don't like it. It's not that I don't like when people come up to me. It's like just in my car. 
that's it but like the minute i step out of my car like i don't care and especially with moses i don't really get as, as awkward he's kind of watches he sees everything so i don't get caught off guard it's just like really i felt really bad everyone's like i know you hate it i'm like no i don't but like screaming laughing all that stuff at me like if you're not gonna come up and talk to me if you're just like screaming in a good way is fine screaming in a bad way like oh yeah, Trisha. oh the one guy did, did you notice the one guy said i was hot today yes did you hear it yeah the guy from the car i don't know if he's being stupid but i got really excited no, was, i think he's uh, more of a oh it's so weird, like the guy at the gas station that like watched it. It's so weird when you, because very rarely do people say it, and I don't care. I really don't like. I mean, you put it out there for a reason, but it, it is it is weird, like an in person interaction. He's like, I like your content, but not like, but you know. You know what I mean? Like that. Yeah. yeah. That's so weird. I'm like, dude, it's fine. Just first of all, I love it because people just always love to shit on how ugly and fat and gross I am. So like. First of all, I take that as, like, the biggest compliment ever because people are so mean. I know I'm not all any of that. Like, I know I'm, like, pretty. I know I'm pretty. Like, I, so it doesn't really bother me. Obviously, the fat stuff does because I'm always insecure on my weight. But, like, it still doesn't bother me. Like, I know I have a good body. Like, I know it looks good. I look, it looks nice. I have a little belly, but that's it. But, <laughs> like, it is nice to hear it. I was very excited. I was like, oh, I still, still got it. Yeah. Because, <laughs> like, you know what? People do hit on me way less than back in the day. And I look well, crazy. You're engaged. Yeah. I don't know. I think, I think it's getting older. But I think you're also not out there as much for people to hit on you. Yeah, well, we're never apart, so that's probably true. No, but in general, like being out there, being available for people to even make a move. Like when? You hardly ever... I've never been out there. No, I'm talking about like DMs. I used to get like so many DMs from well, people. but they know you're engaged, so I think it's a bit different. You're not on the dating mm. sites anymore. Mm -hmm. Alright. Thank you for making me feel better about myself. But if you want to DM mm -hmm. her, it's okay. It will make her feel better. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, honestly, it doesn't. It would make it, no. <laughs> it would give me too big of a head. I think. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think it'd be. What does it matter? You should be confident and have a big head. I don't. I'm very insecure, and you're the last man that wants me. So. <laughs> last man standing. Yeah, literally. I mean, literally that. Oh, wow, there's no line. Usually this is, like, around the block. This is also my place to be recognized. People people love to have a <laughs> meet and greet here. Great. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, my God, the boys. Young boys always also scare me. I don't know why teenagers... I'm, my chemical romance said it best. Teenagers scare the living shit out of me. I swear every time I see teenagers, I'm like, ah, oh, I get more scared of them than anybody. They be crazy. Teenagers feel like they have nothing to lose because they go to juvie until they're 18. They don't get... Literally, they have cups of water. No judgment, but, like that was me <laughs> like literally getting a cup of water that's kind of everything though a bougie star i can't look at here oh wow look at this light babe i'm like an angel ascended mm. are you watching out yeah you see, can't, oh my god i'm so scared i'm so scared i made a contact <gasps> too late you made it the teenage boys aren't the scariest people well actually i really don't they're, they're like people on crack without the crack maybe they're like, on crack <laughs> There's you know, I'm really looking forward to cracking up tonight. I haven't <laughs> cracked up, up in a long time. <laughs> yeah. I just want to crack up. I'm really good. I'm looking forward to cracking up. <laughs> I feel like I was the first person to do my joke on that. I haven't seen that anywhere else. So I feel like I was the first to do that. He's, he's definitely up there with the I love turtles. And... <laughs> I love turtles. That's Apparently. The, you know, that's the little boy from Lizzie McGuire. That's her brother that does that. That says, I'm cracking up. He was like her brother in the TV show. Or the really? movie. Mm -hmm. yeah. oh. I mean, it looks like him. I mean, well, it is him. But I'm saying, it, I can't believe you didn't know because that like, looks no, like him. No, I have no idea. I'm excited to watch Twilight. Are we going to watch it tonight? Wait, what is tonight? No, we have a live show tonight. We do tomorrow. I mean, we don't have to wake up early tomorrow. We can watch. I wanted after. to watch them back to back. I literally was like, I'm ready to watch the next one because I just want to see that character. We can watch one after. Okay. That's true. I'm going live tonight on my main channel check it out become a member i do exclusive videos that don't get shown anywhere else and people really like it i'm getting a lot of good feedback like all the comments are like i love these thank you so much i think i post there more than i post vlogs or main channel like sometimes i forget to make a main channel or vlog video but check it out members only we go live this this car taking like should i should I well she's order? on the phone so she's talking <gasps> to someone on the phone no yeah. oh my god no why is it always a honda no judgment but it's always freaking <laughs> hondas that take so long at a fast food so okay. she's on the phone and she's reading the menu and she's should i yell over you to order i feel self-conscious not that those guys Did are there yell over you so i can order so they know my voice isn't that yeah. what we're gonna do 
Yeah. I mean, anyway, they can hear you from there. Like, well, what do you, you want? To, do you, I Mocha? can tell them I'm here with Trisha. <laughs> no, 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 no. Because also, it's YouTube. hell embarrassing that these people do not care about me. I always say they, like, love me here, and then they might not care. Cool with the I feel like I'm looking, I'm like, like Edward. You're like, from, yeah, from Twilight now. Bring it closer to your eye. When the sun is in it. Poof. My hair is, like, there it is. See me for what I am. See me in the sunlight. This is what it does to me. My eyes do look really cool. I mean... Okay. All right. Okay. Oh, 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 that's Joel's scene. <laughs> okay, I was listening to him. Okay, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be. What do you want? Why do you want a No, I don't want you. You don't want anything? <gasps> Babe. Babe, order. He said one second. Oh. <laughs> Jeez. You sure you don't want anything? It's like a, it's a fun night tonight. We're doing a live show. Just strawberry acai lemonade. Hi, yes. Can I get a large pink drink? Of course. And, and can we also get, um, what size? Medium size. Can I get a medium size strawberry refresher? Strawberry refresher, you Yes. Okay. And then do you guys have any Halloween cups? Any, uh, sorry, which of the Pops? No, Halloween cups. Oh, I don't, I don't think we have quite yet. You don't have the spider webs? Uh, no, no, I don't see any. Okay, no worries. That's it then. That. No worries. Anything else for you today? That's it. Alright, perfect. We'll see you one Oh, we're going to say, hey, thanks. We have a hummus box. They're catering to you. <laughs> They're catering to the Israelis. <laughs> no, actually, the hummus thing is for the vegetarians. Oh, People right, that are right, vegetarian right. and vegan. They like, love it. Because I remember when I moved here, nobody wanted to even hear about hummus. And then, <laughs> and then suddenly all the hippies, the vegetarians, the vegans, like, hummus. They get all excited about it. Weird. So we should go to the lawns by Home Goods. Oh, really cool. Look at me. This is what I am. This is what the sun does to me. Say I should do it from this way. If I, oh my god, wow, that's like... I hear the bell. <laughs> I'm the Edward. If I wasn't so shiny right now, this would be... Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> they had like one, two, the whole song. Oh yeah. Dee 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 What do you mean? So like... Dun, 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 dun. I mean, babe, look at me just in the light right now. I'm just like in oh, this light been, shining. Like, oh, you're always not. You remember that Russian girl? Who? Oh, uh, well, we don't. I don't think she's Russian. She's something weird. She's like from a country I never heard of. Are you talking about that young girl with the big blue eyes that's always up close to the camera on TikTok? Yeah. She looks like she'd be your she's daughter. She's not Russian, though. Oh, thank you. I Are you sure she's? No, she's mm. from a weird country. We looked it up. It was something with like a B, but it wasn't like Bulgaria. But it's like one of those weird ones. Like, literally, really? I'll let me look it up and I'll tell you guys in a second. One second. Hundred people there. Hi. See, I told you people knew me. <laughs> She's from Belarus, by the way. But is that maybe a town in Russia? Oh, maybe it's a town in Russia. <laughs> oh, unless it's Belarus. It oh, maybe Belarus. B-L-A-I. Hi. I told you. I told you people know who I am. No, this place, like, literally, they, like... That was right. so funny, because then I looked to the left and like there's a whole window with people waving. That was so funny. <laughs> that was too funny. Honestly, like my ego would have been hurt, because this is like my spot. This is the meet and greet. I come through the Starbucks and people are just like lined up for me. It gives me an ego boost, because the internet just hates me. So I just you come through my Starbucks. <laughs> I thought you were telling me to work here that just for I a job. To get a job. <laughs> you said that the other day too. You're like, oh, they're hiring at the pumpkin patch. Oh, yeah. I was like, okay, you get a job there. How about that? <laughs> no. Oh my god, it was so weird. I was like, was rude. Cool. <laughs> I would love to get I mean, a job here. Obviously, no, it's a joke. Brick wall, waterfall, girl. You think you got it all? You don't. I do. So boom with that attitude. I never heard that. Reese's PC cap and crunch. Fuck with me, and I'll fuck you up. <laughs> <laughs> I could be from Bolaris. I'm telling you, she looks like she's your daughter. Oh, 
so nice. I wish I looked like that girl. She's so freaking pretty. I never looked like that. Like now with full glam and hair and makeup, maybe kind of, sort of, almost there, but. Maybe. She's gorgeous. <sighs> she's beautiful. She looks kind. Don't, now if I say hi to these people, don't pick up my camera okay, and film I them. I like your car, it's so pretty. Thank you, I like your hair. Thank you. <laughs> Our car is broken because like we suck. Oh. If you're comfortable, I can take your car to the front register and bring oh. you up over there. Do you want cash or? We have cash. Yeah, we can, we can do cash. Whatever is easier. But nowadays, like people wear masks, so. Okay, but don't film. Most of them like film people like as they come up to me. I'm like, why do they don't want to be filmed? Just don't film them as they do. Thank you. Because some people don't want to be on camera. They don't want to say hi. They're trying not to be out there. Oh, yeah. Here, Thank you. Is that what that's the name of Yeah, Pink Yeah. Oh, it's so good. Have you ever had it? No. Oh, you'll like it. I haven't had one of these in so long. It's like strawberry milk. It's really good. I feel like it should have like coconut in, in it, too. Something. I think so. mm -hmm. It's almost like pina colada. <laughs> mm -hmm. Something like that, Moe's. This is so exciting. I love getting Starbucks. I don't know what to do. This is such a, I'm in an awkward position now. Do I get out and say hi, or are we going to just drive past? Because, like, they're waiting, well, but, like, what are they waiting Well, you can for? step out, and then I'll start filming you with them. No. Well. <laughs> um. It's like I want to say hi, but it's, like, such an awkward thing. So I'm not like, hey, guys. Just Ready invite for them picture? to the live show. <laughs> Come become a member and then I'll say hi to you on the live show. Just kidding. Um, okay. This is so good. Yeah, I mean, it's rare having it close. I know. I do have to get home to the live show because I have to pee too. I'll be a little late. No, I won't. I'll probably be right on time. Usually when I'm late, I'm right on time. Oh, I was looking for my phone. I just want a baby so we can see what we look like meshed together. There's softwares for that. I can't believe, like, it's just so weird when you think about, like, a baby being half you, half me. That's crazy. And there's that one for you. Thank guys. you. No, I don't think so. Thank you. Bye. Oh, oh. I better say hi. I better say hi. I just, I just better say hi because I'm not gonna. Okay. <laughs> don't film. Don't whatever you do. Do not film me. <laughs> Babe, you have to film. No. Okay. I'm like, wait, so you guys aren't all together? You just like all hang out. Yeah, so they're like, no, we don't know them. 
No, but I was like that in high school. Like we would have hangout areas. Oh. And just all the young kids will hang out in one area. And not everyone knew everyone, but you know. I'm so funny. I'm so cool people even care. <laughs> I literally am like on the YouTube. I'm like, literally nobody watches me. And then I see. But you know what? Even if I got like 100 views. Hi. <laughs> Someone's waiting right there. Even if I get 100 views, I know I'll always be iconic. So I never worry about it. I'm like, even if no one watched me, I'll always be an icon of YouTube. So I, I sleep well knowing that. I'm like, I could just fall off and be like, Trisha was iconic. Come on, Tammy Faye. A beacon. Yeah. Um, of what? A beacon of light. Kind of like Tammy Faye Baker. If she got her own movie, I mean, I'm destined to have my own movie one day. You know what I mean? Do you ever get scared who's going to play you? I don't think I'm in the movie. Literally, you are. Like, Brittany, <laughs> even that one paparazzi weirdo boyfriend, you're like my husband. Like, you'll definitely be in the movie. I don't know for how long. Depends on how long in my life you are, but. Oh, wow. Well, hopefully, we're not. Someone at our doorbell. Should I look? Oh. It's the end of the night. I got on my sad boy t shirt, which is so freaking comfortable. I cut the neck off. These are perfect to glam in. They're perfect to sleep in. They're just so freaking comfortable. This one's so soft. So we're going to do a get and ready with me. I always take these on my members only. So if you want to subscribe to my main channel's membership. So I put member only videos out probably more frequently than I post here. Because if you are nice over there. Not that you guys aren't all nice and lovely. But they're really nice over there. So if you want to become a member, do that. But yeah, sadboy2005.com. She was a successful launch. We just finished a really good live chat over on my main channel. And it was a lot of fun. So we're going to go do makeup. I might take my wig off if you want to see this process. Because this is glued i like don't know how i'm gonna get this off then you can subscribe to my members only otherwise i'm gonna leave you here as a good night i love you guys stay beautiful i mean i think you need to wet it or something <sighs> like maybe with like a washcloth to like kind of just loosen it oh it's not going to turn I don't think I don't know how much you felt when I'm always like something the most. Let's get it warm. But I don't wanna. <laughs> I mean, I don't wanna run the wig, but honestly, this wig like, is so. Like, you know where I said my jaw was hurting? I think he did my braids so tight. Like, my jaw has been killing me. My teeth feel like they're like loosening. Like, I think the braids are so tight and this is so tight. I feel like I'm like losing circulation. Like, I think that's what it was. It's like, I had a headache in the car, I wasn't feeling well, and I was feeling lightheaded on the way over. Even after I was on eating, I was feeling lightheaded, so I was like, I think they're just little. And I don't realize it at this point, I feel fine, and now I'm like, oh, it's a little too tight. It's like, it's in my head. I think it's not one yet. I'm just buying it as a new vlog. Did you cut your shirt that way or did it come like that? No, this is how you want That's why I get there. It's all things? Yep. All things and all rolled up. I wonder why they make necks so tight on t shirts in general. Like, why do they make them so tight? Whose head fits through those holes? Uh, maybe aesthetically. Do we do soap or you just do water? Just warm water. I think maybe aesthetically they just think that it's. Yeah. I guess it's like a finished, but I like how it has that, that line. Let me just see if, if this is open. Yeah, it's kind of open, but... Maybe doing it all over the hairline, just kind of rubbing it. Just I think once it opens up a bit, it's easier to just... Okay. Keep going. Just let me know what you feel. Do I don't feel anything right now? Because I see that it's like... Red. No, like on your hair. Like I don't want it to pull your hair. Yeah, same. It looks so bomb, but then it's so hard to get off. I think we might need water and soap. So, does it? Oh yeah, it's like on my. That's what I mean. That's kind of hair. Because the skin's not like so bad. Steam almost, like you know. Mhm. Mm like rubbing alcohol too. Do we have any? Because rubbing alcohol takes it off. I've done that with wigs in the past. Like the glue. Mhm. Mm I mean, there is, you would have it somewhere. I had it somewhere, but I don't know. I'm sure we can get clothes here. I mean, it definitely helps, you know. I'm just like, it's squeezing your head from the back. Is this, is there like things over here? 
<laughs> it's not like glue, I think it's like bobby pins over here. No, sometimes the, the thing itself has some little stick. Oh, it feels like so close to getting off. Has to pull down and then out. Oh, and there's, I'm just trying to get these bobby pins out because they're like right on the ear. Oh. oh, yeah, I feel that now. Down and then out. No, yeah, it's like. Oh, there's another bobby pin in there, right there. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, there's a bobby pin. <laughs> oh my god, I feel like this is what giving birth feels like. Oh. Ah. <laughs> uh, Why? It's like a trap. I know. <laughs> I should tell him oh, no it's bobby the pins. Ones are, like, it's, a, it's the ones that are like broken. Angle. Yeah. Oh. Jesus. Oh. Oh my god. No one. No one. Unless you wear wigs will know that feeling of a wig. People who wear wigs for a long period of time, I have no idea how you do it. I commend you because I would wanted to wear that tomorrow and I was like, there's just no way. I will. Why is it so tight? Yeah, the braids were really tight. I'm going to have to tell them to loosen up the braids because honestly, I my jaw was hurting today and I couldn't figure out why. I was like, maybe you clenched on your jaw. I'm like, I don't, I don't clench my jaw. I don't know. Oh, they are so tight. Oh, yeah, I can literally feel my jaw loosening. That's so crazy. No, but you should close your braids, but you don't use bobby pins on the braids. Uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I felt it being, it being tighter today, too. I don't know. Even in the morning, I'm just, like, so energetic. I'm ready for the day. I'm so excited. I'm no, catching up with my friends. and like, don't think about it. And, like, after, I'm like, oh, my God, this hurts. Also, the wig, I mean, you have a big, you make it big. So, why is the hair <laughs> right. so tight if you're trying to make it big anyway? <laughs> Just adds to the volume. That's good. Good question, babe. These are the answers we'll never know. Um, I mean, we could know, but. Can we really ask it? Well, would you ask Picasso why he painted clocks melting instead of regular? No, but I would ask him why he mixes certain oh. chemicals. Who? Hmm? Picasso. He would. <laughs> Why he makes certain chemicals? I would ask him a technical question, but not an artistic decision. Oh, okay. I don't think he used chemicals. I think he used paint. They literally did invent like. Paint. They invented what? Paint, like the paints. Because back then they used to use like you know fruits and vegetables, and like they invented how to get colors. Like it's not you couldn't go to a paint <laughs> store and buy colors. So they had to come up with ways to make the colors and paint and... This is the time of day when Moses' intelligence goes above my head and I'm just like, I don't know. I don't even know what we're speaking anymore. Because I know you're saying something so intelligent and insightful and I can't comprehend it at all. I'm like, what are you talking about? But I know you're saying something really smart and I'm sorry that I can't appreciate this intellectual conversation because it does sound amazing. I just can't grasp what's happening. <laughs> you ever feel like you're on a reality show? I feel like I'm on the Truman Show and you're a paid actor. I mean, I'm on the Truman Show. I mean, I. Well, I don't know if that really is how it works, but. Well. Like, I really do feel like you're the one, and they're no, like, you it's know. It's a person that it doesn't make sense for him to be in the show that's in the show. But, like, where would I have seen your episodes? What do you mean? I mean, I haven't seen any of the Moses episodes, like, you know, like, if you're like. That's life... what I mean. There's a network that we don't know about. That oh, maybe them. we're, like, cross-promoting on each other's shows, you think? 
They're like, we're gonna give him a spinoff. <laughs> oh, that, that should have been a thing where there are two people on the Truman Show. Uh, that's what you want. You want to be Truman. Together. I don't want anything. <laughs> I'm just saying it makes more sense mm -hmm. if we thought about it. The person that doesn't know is the one on the show, not the one that's constantly suspected. I feel like I'm like programmed to film everything. Oh my god. Oh my god. I just want to freaking live because I'm thankful for that. It's kind of cute though, this hair. It's always fun after, after you take off the braid. How do I look? You look like a Britney Spears on a casual day. <laughs> so specific. <laughs> Britney Spears when she's driving her white Mercedes down Thousand Oaks Boulevard. Thank you. I like that you get out of the frame when you're done. <laughs> was that your exit? Okay, bye. That was not that bad. Would it take nine minutes? This one? No, it's more the glue. I think that was the top one. Oh, you're so cute. Well, this is 177 pounds. I'm so jealous. Pretty much been the same since high school. <laughs> Triggered. <laughs> what is this? My fault. Oh. <laughs> All right, that's been another get unready with us. Thumbs up if you like this video. I look good like this, right? Yeah, it's always good. Cause you like curls. It's got like funny mm -hmm. little curls. It was look good. at the back. It hurts so long. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh, it feels so good out here. Love it. Me too. <laughs> You're gonna stop perfect in everything you do over a TV. I love you. What time is it? Is it too late to watch Twilight? No, I wanna watch one. Okay, let's go watch it. <laughs>